Hello everyone! In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a listing on eBay from CJ Dropshipping. So, for those who don't know, basically CJ Dropshipping is a platform that allows you to find a lot of product that you can sell later on on whatever shop you have. Maybe you have Shopify as your online store or maybe you have Wix.com. You can use CJ as the source of your product because they have a lot of product from various vendor that you can drop ship to multiple country. So if you're going to use eBay for your main online store, I'm going to show you how you can create a listing with CJ Dropshipping. First of all, before you start creating your listing, I recommend you to verify your account first or to verify your data first. And to do that, all you have to do is click on my eBay on the top right of your screen and then go to account. And then you're going to want to go to your personal information. Here you'll be able to see your email as well as phone numbers. Mine is already verified. And if yours haven't, you can go ahead and verify it first before you continue and watch this tutorial. Once you've done that, now we can go to our CJ dropshipping. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go to our personal dashboard on CJ dropshipping. So to do that, go ahead and click on the top right of your screen like this and then click on the name of your account and you will be brought to my CJ dashboard. And what you're going to do is you're going to want to click on the store symbols right here and you'll be able to find a selections of store that you can connect into CJ dropshipping. You can connect your Shopify your TikTok shop, your Wix website, etc. But today we're going to focus on the eBay store. And here it says here that I haven't authorized any stores yet. So to do that, all I have to do is just click on add store. And then CJ Dropshipping is going to show us the application access and you can just read on it. And if you're okay with it, we can go ahead and click on agree and continue. And that is it. Your store is already connected to CJ Dropshipping. Now let's try and check whether it is the right shop that we have right here. So I'm going to go back to eBay and it says right here that this is the name of my store. And if you would like to recheck whether it is the right store or not, all you have to do is go back to your eBay and then go to my ebay and on the summary section you will find this name on the right side of your screen and this is the name of your store and as you can see it shows the right one so i can continue and try to find product for my ebay now to start and search product for your ebay all you have to do is click on this find product options on the navigation bars right here and then what you're going to do is you're going to want to scroll down until you find this recommended product for e-commerce platform sections and right here you're going to be able to see a selections of e-commerce platform that we can use and of course i'm going to go ahead and click on ebay and now we've come to the sections where all of the product here are going to be suitable to be sell on ebay and of course it's going to depend on what kind of shop you will want to build on ebay whether it's maybe an electronic shop or a home appliance shop or maybe a beauty shop you can go ahead and choose on the product that you will want to sell on your ebay and in order to help you do that you can go ahead and click on this plus sign besides the category option and then you're going to be able to sort on what kind of category you'll want to put on your ebay there is computer and office bags and shoes jewelry and watches health beauty hair and so on so let's say that i want to sell jewelry and watches i'm just going to go ahead and click on that so it's not available at the moment so i'm going to try and search for something else all right so i got some selections of stuff that i can sell on the bags and shoes category and let's say that i want to sell this one on my ebay and all I have to do is just click on list right here. And through here, I'll be able to list it on my eBay. So I have connected my Shopify store into my CJ dropshipping. That's why it shows 
that I have several selections on my store. I'm just going to change it into my eBay. And here it says that we have to make sure that the total quantity of the product listed does not exceed the listing limit on eBay or the product will be removed when the inventory runs out. And you can learn more about that by clicking on this how to increase listing quantities on eBay button or you can also take a look at your summary account. And then let's say that I'm going to go to my account right here. And if I go to the selling sections and click on overview, I will be able to see that I have 250 item that I can list on my eBay. So it says here that I have 70 item left to list on eBay and it means that I'm good to go. I can just continue and proceed with this listing. So all of these details below are going to be automatically filled with the data from the product that I'm going to list. And as the payment method, I can choose whether I want to use Payoneer or PayPal. I'm just going to choose Payoneer. And you can add tags if you want. I'm okay with everything that is listed right here. So I'm just going to continue and click on the variant pricing. So here we'll be able to select on the pricing of our product as well as choosing whether we want to insert all of the variety of the product into our store or not. So let's say that I only want to add several of this product. All I have to do is uncheck on this box right here. And let's say I want to sell this one, this one, and this two. And then I can go to the images and video sections. And if you remember, I didn't put all of the products. So I'm just going to uncheck on all of the product that I will not put into my store. All right. And we can also settings on the description. And once we're done, we can go ahead and click on list it now. And now we will have to wait until the product is being listed into our eBay account. All right, so sometimes problem might occur that you might not be able to list a product and you can learn more about it by clicking on this link right here. And it says, And it's going to give you all of the reason why. Your product will not be able to be listed into your eBay directly from CJ Dropshipping. All right, so it says here, one of the reason why the product will not be able to be listed is because the account type is not a business type. It says here that the account that we're using needs to be for a business account. And if the eBay account is an individual account, that is not going to be allowed to list from CJ. And when I go back to my eBay, it says that mine is actually an individual account. So if you want to create this listing, you can do it with the way that I've told you throughout this video, but just make sure that you are using the business account on eBay. And if you want to create a business account in order to proceed to create a listing from CJ Dropshipping, all you have to do is try to find how to create a business account on eBay. Then you will be able to find this link right here. Through here, you'll be able to create your business account. And then you can go ahead and enter your business name, your email, your password, as well as your business location. Then once it's created, you can use the exact same step like how I shown you in the beginning of the video when you're trying to create a listing on your eBay. And that's basically it. That is how you can 
create a listing on eBay with CJ Dropshipping. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.